almost for last 20 years we tried various measures to standardize the practices so that we could reduce the maternal mortality and morbidity. Initially, our efforts were all targeted towards the consultants, gynecologists, and believe me, it's sometimes more difficult to change the mindset of consultants because they have been practicing in a particular way in their own way for 25, 30, 35 years. On the other hand, what we realized was as we went to periphery, the staff training is deficient. It's difficult to get trained staff for the hospital and that's how gradually this Manyata program has now evolved. We started with a huge number of standards. We, initially, we selected 52, we thrashed it down to 37, and then we were uh, assessing on 37 standards. And um, then we brought it down um, to, in Manita, 16 basic standards. If you've seen the centers, Mumbai and Bokaro, and uh, I'm sure you've gone around and seen, seen the demographic profile also, the hospitals in Mumbai and the hospitals here, and uh, you'll realize that the infrastructures is heaven and hell difference. So now, why don't we spend that huge amount on an infrastructure? Obviously, we would spend on the things which count in saving the life. Maybe a tile flow may not be helpful. The awareness of my nurses, the basic equipments, that is more important. These criteria can be very easily followed by uh, the staff. Even they, if they are not formally trained, they can follow these criteria very easily because they are down to earth and practical criteria. 